Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Yen, and today I have a thrift haul to share with you all. I actually went thrifting during Memorial Day, and the thrift store I went to had a sale. Different locations actually had some sales, but unfortunately, I could only go to one, so I do have some things to share with you guys, and I honestly forgot what I picked up, so this will be exciting for me as well. I'll reflect and see if some of these purchases were worth it or not. But if you guys are new here, I love filming thrift videos and I do resell online. So I will leave my closet down below and my Depop shop. So don't forget to subscribe as well. Please ignore my hair and just the glare in my glasses. I had to put my hair up because I just showered and I wanted to get this video up for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoy and let's get started. So we're going to start off with this big bag and I found two of the same dresses so I guess I would just start with that. This brand is a new to me brand. This company I think is in Australia. So I found this gorgeous dress. It's just like almost off the shoulder if not off the shoulder with this front bow detail and the brand is actually Runaway. So it looks like this. This is in the size US2. It's actually brand new with tag. Super cute. It's a midi length dress. More body con at the bottom with the zipper on the back. This one was originally $16.91 and I got it half off. I found the exact dress and it's the same size and everything but this was only $14.91. So I asked the cashier to price match for me and they were able to do that so I was really happy. Hopefully this item will sell well. I wanted to try this out myself, but it's a perfect dress for a wedding guest. And I also love this color for summer. The next item I picked up is another dress. And this is a new to me brand as well. This is also new with tags, so I was really excited. It is called the C slash MEO Collective. It's in the size extra small and I will show you guys the brand. So it looks like this. And this is their tag. So I've never heard of this brand, but it's a very nice, interesting dress. And I love a unique dress. So this was $16.91 as well. I got a half off. I don't have this button for you guys. I guess it buttons all the way down on the front. And I would say this is like a midi length. It also has this like strap that I tie in the front. So kind of covers in the front and the sleeves look like this just a really nice cotton dress so i thought this was really interesting i wanted to try this out i will also leave comps on the screen just because i'm also curious to see what my projected sales price will be but i picked up this zara tweed blazer and it's just a very cute white blazer jacket these items sell so well for me i sold one i think it was a blogger's favorite and i sold it for around 90 dollars so i didn't even look up comps for this jacket because it was just in really great condition this is in the size extra large so a really great size and it was 14.91 so not too bad some of these zara pieces are interesting because sometimes they can sell for over the retail so hopefully that is one of the items next up i found this everlane dress and i was really excited because i didn't see the brand initially and i thought this material was really great it's just a blue stripe pinstripe dress so very cute with the buttons on the front and i think this hits around the knees or maybe midi length it's just a very perfect vacation dress with the belt tie so i thought that was perfect this is in the size six the price marked on this was 14.91 it's the perfect time to list this dress so i will get that up asap and then i found two dresses that i'm very excited about one is just black and one is white i've never found this brand before it's just a white dress but in front all the way down and it is a short dress as well there is this tie on the back but it was nothing really special so i looked at the brand tag and it says and other stories so i know that brand will do really well um i don't know the comps yet because I was just really excited to have found both of these dresses so I just grabbed them. This one is in the size US2. I got it for $9.98 so I just thought it was a pretty good price. And they're both the same so this one is also in the size US2. It's just a black version. 
this next piece I just picked it up for myself and it is just a Shein brand so Shein is not that great I don't really like reselling Shein but this was in the size US 6 a size medium and I picked this up for myself because it is very cute it's just a cropped green sweatshirt and I love to have these things to lounge around in or to wear to the gym I bought this for $5.98 so half of that would be like three dollars so i got another piece for myself and this is again by shein i bought this cute white dress i just needed a white dress because i have my bachelorette coming up and just some bridal stuff i love a cow neckline it's just a short satin white dress and the back is open i got this for 5.98 again and then i found these two lingerie dresses so i was really excited because they're both by victoria's secret this one is in the size extra small and it was $7.98 but just a really cute, I would say a red, it's not a hot pink. This is just polyester but it looks like this, very adorable and very popular as well and it has the front slit. So I do have this one I think on my Depop and Poshmark but in black so now I'm very excited to have this red one and I love picking up lingerie this one is the same thing so I was very excited but it is just a purple the straps are a little bit different but I do love this lace detail and also again with the trim this one has the bow so very adorable and this one is in the size medium and I got this for $7.98 now I'm going to move on to this second bag so I think I have just a bunch of jeans in here. I'm very surprised because I actually don't remember finding a lot of denim. This is the first pair. It is just a light wash and it's an older style. But this is actually by Versace. So it looks like this on the back and the brand tag is like this. So I don't think this is like really expensive but I'm not sure. The style is a little bit older. I do still like it though and it looks really cool. The leg looks like this has a little bit of a taper look this one was $9.98 so not bad at all this is in the size 28 maybe I can try this on and hopefully it looks good honestly I have to give credit to my fiance because he went thrifting with me and he is in charge of the denim section so I was pretty happy with these items that he brought to me so get you a well-trained partner that will help you thrift the next item that I purchased was this rag and bone pair of jeans and it is a black softer cotton material this is called the high-rise ankle skinny and it was $12.91 this is brand new with tags so that's the only reason why I picked it up and it is in the size 27 if it wasn't new with tag i might have just left this behind and then i got a pair of madewell jeans so i love finding madewell sometimes they sit for me but sometimes they move really quickly so this was 7.98 and it is in the size 27 tall this is in the style 10 inch high rise skinny it's just a really nice classic black skinny pair and i think these will do well still just because some people just love wearing skinny jeans i got this pair of free people jeans and i don't really pick up free people jeans but this is a trendier style and that's what i look for when i look at jeans it's just this nice rigid denim with some stretch to it but the leg is like a raw hem a little bit of a wide leg and it has a really unique detail I don't think you guys can see it like right here it was only $5.98 so a really great price and this is in the size 27 regular so I wonder if this is just from the same person I guess the last item that I found was also another pair of Madewell jeans and this is also in a black color this one is a little bit more of a washed out black. It was only $9.98 and this is called the Cali Demi Boots and I think this style is more desirable. It's also in the size 29 so a really great size and it looks like this. A raw hem again with a little bit of a flare or like a boot cut so I do like that style and I think this one will move faster than the other pair. So those were everything that I picked up on Memorial Day. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I was pretty happy looking back on all of the items that I picked up. Hopefully they move fast, but 
I'm just excited to get these items listed. So if you guys are interested, feel free to DM me on Instagram or just wait and check out my Poshmark. But if you guys haven't subscribed, please subscribe down below. It would mean a lot to me. And also give this video a big thumbs up if you guys haven't already. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!